Hey guys, so I know it's been a very long time since I've um, filmed a video, but I really wanted to upload one up today. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna start out. Oh, it's gonna be a face and outfit of the night. So, for my face, I use for my eyes, I use a naked palette, and then I have naked all over my lid, and then I have Buck in my crease and outer corner, and then I also have Dark Horse in my outer corner as well. And then I have these colors also in my underneath my lash line and then on my waterline I usually don't do that but I used um, black eyeliner but the one I have is really crappy because I usually don't use any eyeliner so that's it I'm going really fast because gotta be at the restaurant really soon and also it's been like six times that I'm refilming this video because every time someone interrupts me so yeah I'm kind of really mad that it's been like six times that I'm filming this video but whatever I really want to film it so I have on my lips it's by Rimmel and it's Lady Extaz. It's just like a hot, really bright pink. Um, it's maybe like too much my lips with my eye makeup, but I really wanted to wear this lipstick and I wanted to put makeup. I wanted like to do something with my eyes because lately I've been wearing like really um, not much makeup. So yeah. Um, and then for my hair, it's just oh, and then for my blush, sorry. I have this one by e.l.f. I usually don't wear it because it's too like pink and sparkly, but it's Fuchsia Fusion, but I only used a little bit of it. Yeah, and then for my nails, I have, it's by Sinful Colors, and it's called Forever Pink. No, Pink Forever, sorry. just looks like that. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it for my face, and I have like bronzer for Forever 20, foundation, and yeah. Okay, and then for my accessories, I have these bracelets. Um, my friend actually gave them to me for my birthday. They're from February 21. And then I have this ring. used to be my grandmother's. And then this one also. This one is an older ring. And then this one is a ring when I was a little baby. And um, I started wearing it like a month ago as an over knuckle ring. So I've been wearing these rings pretty much every single day. And then for my bracelets, I have this one is from Urban Planets, like a wrap around bracelet. And then I have this one is by Betsy Johnson. I wear these two pretty much every single day too. Oh, and then for my hair, what I did is I just like used little bobby pins and I put my hair up like that. And then I curled a few pieces and then I did my bangs. And then for more more volume, I used this Aussie Awesome Volume Hairspray. It's really good. It leaves your hair crunchy though. But it's great for volume and it smells really good. So and it's really cheap. So if you're looking for a great like volume volumalizing hairspray, then this one is really good. And then for my I think I said everything for my face, but if I missed anything, I'm gonna leave it in the down bar. But I think I said everything. So for my outfit, I have this blouse is from Urban Planet and it has like lace, lacy shoulders, um, lace on the sleeves. And then, um, it's not a bra, it's like a band, lacy bandeau top. So, yeah, but like my hair covers up pretty much everything, so. Um, and then I have this belt, it's from Forever 21, it's just like a chain, I really like it. And then I have also a floral skirt from Forever 21. So it looks like that. I'm sorry, my ring is like a really big mess. Um, but what I did with my skirt is, because I like to wear um, bodycone skirts, but sometimes I feel like they're just too tight everywhere. And sometimes I um, don't like, I usually don't like to wear really tight fitting clothing. So what I do with bodycone skirts, because I really like to wear them, but I don't really like that they're like too form fitting, whatever. What I do is um, I leave it like untucked in the front like this and then... Um, it looks kind of funny right now, but usually it looks great. But, um, yeah, I just leave it like that in the front. And then in the back, I actually, like, tuck my skirt in. So it looks, like, better like that, I guess. Because you can still see the skirt because the shirt is not, like, completely covering up your skirt. So you have, like, the best of both, or best of both worlds. Um, if you don't want, really, to show your tummy, um... Because, like, the body cone skirt is just, like, too tight and it's not really firing for you. Like, it's not really for me. Um, so that's what I do. So, looks like that. And then in the back, well, it's tucked 
in. And then um, for my um, bag, I never want to carry a big bag. But the only thing though, I just only have like one clutch, black clutch. But like, I don't know, because my belt is like a chain and the clutch is has a chain also. So I think it's kind of strange. Sorry. It doesn't look good together, but whatever. Um, you can't really see the belt that much. So, yeah, like that. So this is how it looks. Oh, and this skirt, this skirt. I'm sorry, I'm all, like all over the place. I'm like shaking because I'm really hungry. But um, this clutch used to be my mom's 20 years ago. So yeah. And then oh, for my shoes, it's probably kind of really weird for some of you, but um, I'm wearing combat boots and I don't have any tights and I'm wearing floral skirt, so it might be like weird for you. But I kind of like to wear combat boots with like floral skirts. I don't know. <laughs> so. They look like that. They're um, just from like Urban Planet. And, whoa, sorry. Yeah, so that's my outfit and face of the night. I'm really sorry. This video is really not good. But I'm still like filming something. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Ooh. Okay. So, um, hope you enjoyed this video. Hope it was kind of helpful for you if like you want to wear bodycomb skirts but you think you don't have the body for it you I mean you do you just have like if you want to cover up your belly then that's what you do you just like leave your shirt untucked in the front and then you tuck it in in the back so yeah if you have any requests in the down bar then you can just leave them um if you have any requests just leave them in the comments below and I don't tweet anymore so I mean don't follow me on twitter because I don't tweet <laughs> and um, yeah, I'm gonna, school is out in two weeks, so I'm gonna be able to film videos again. I'm really excited. I really want to start filming videos, but also I want to work this summer, so we'll see how it goes. I still have to find a job. But, um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this, and I'll be making more videos. And, yeah, I hope this video was not, like, too all over the place. So, yeah, I'm just gonna go because I'm really hungry, and, yeah, I'll see you in my next video, hopefully hopefully soon so yeah but thank you for still being subscribed to me it means a lot because i don't make any videos anymore but i i'm still alive and i'm still going to be uploading some okay so i have like one minute left on my camera so i'm just better like hurry up and like end this video and yeah sorry for all the rap, rap rambling. i wanted to say like babbling babbling and ram whatever okay bye